Introducing the new open source microscopy concept, Olympus presents the IX3 range of inverted microscope frames. A swappable deck design allows optical modules to be easily exchanged into the accessible infinite light path for a flexible imaging system that can be molded to suit the diverse needs of the user. A range of optical modules is currently available for effortless integration into the light path of the IX3 frame. With the included tools, installation is quick and easy, as shown here with the encoded intermediate magnification changer, which allows precise control and recording of settings between 1, 1.6 and 2 times magnification. Used alone, this is ideal for selecting the optimal view in bright field imaging, such as during in vitro fertilization procedures, or with these HeLa cells observed during DIC. Fluorescence imaging is possible with the inclusion of the filter turret module. The external light source is connected via the rear port and up to eight filter positions are available. The optical path has also been enhanced to include extra-large mirrors increasing the field of view. Capture of HeLa cells stained for imaging of mitochondria and endoplasmic reticulum is achieved here using separate filter positions merged to form a multi-channel image. Two filter turrets in the light path enables advanced imaging techniques by providing distinct light sources for imaging and activation. This is ideal for photoactivation experiments such as this study of actin dynamics. Actin is fused to a photoconvertible fluoro 4 and activated with a burst of light for visualization. The third Olympus module currently available is the right side port for access to external components such as detectors and light sources. This allows an additional laser to be directed into the infinite light path for FRAP experiments, such as here where photo bleaching is performed together with image capture. Building upon these setups, the Olympus IX3 system can be easily adapted for dual camera use. The filter turret can be combined with an additional camera via the right side port module with a C-mount. This is ideally suited to the analysis of pathology sections, which exhibit different features when visualized with color or fluorescence. An example of dual camera use can be seen with this colon carcinoma section, imaged using both a color camera and a monochrome camera. The Olympus Z Drift Compensation Module is an available upgrade for the IX83 model shown here and automatically maintains precise image focus. This is perfect for time-lapse experiments such as this three-day time-lapse capture of cell division labeled with the fluorescent ubiquitination cell cycle indicator. The Olympus breadboard support for third-party modules allows the users to set up their own customized systems, which is where the concept of open source microscopy really comes into its own. Although the IX3 frames are used with custom modules, users can still access the benefits of the Z Drift compensation module. Who knows where this handing over of system design to the microscopy community will lead? It will certainly push the boundaries of new technologies. Visit us online today to discover where the Olympus IX3 range will lead you.